Patrick Stufel. Uh, I graduated from Portland Public Schools last year and I had the privilege to be on the Superintendent's Student Advisory Council as well as the Citizens Budget Review Committee. So I'm fairly informed about the budget and how the state process works. But um, today I'm coming to you as a Future Connect scholar for Portland Community College. Uh, what Future Connect is so great about is it connects low-income students that wouldn't really have the means to attend college to attend college, but also they connect them with a college success coach, a person that meets with you one-on-one -on -one to see exactly what you need to succeed. Uh, my story, um, I grew up in Southeast Portland right down the street, um, went to 13 different schools until I landed at uh, Franklin High School. Um, I come from a low-income family, so having a bunch of learning gaps from moving from school to school and not having the money to go to college Last June, I really wasn't sure what I was going to do. I didn't think it was in my grasp to go to college. But when PCC came to me and said, hey, here's an option, I jumped on it. I really want to thank PCC for that opportunity. <laughs> my advice uh, for the board tonight, um, I request that you guys just take into consideration and account um, all the low-income families um, that, you know, face a lot of different problems and challenges uh, to find a post-secondary education. I just want you guys to consider um, all the aspects of the challenges of uh, con not only uh, continuing post-secondary and succeeding, but having an opportunity. Mm -hmm. I want to thank you. Thanks for the opportunity to be here today. Uh, my name is Jeremy Selinger, and I'm the student body president for Portland Community College of Southeast Campus. Uh, currently, I'm just a couple of terms away from completing my first degree, which is an Associate of Science at Oregon Transfer degree in business, um, which I'm very excited about. Uh, college has been a rocky conquest for me, uh, trying to find a balance between work, school, homework, and life. Um, and it's been, it can be quite overwhelming at times, but it is safe to say that I wouldn't be where I am today without the opportunities that community college has provided me. Um, community college has allowed me to, the flexibility to continue my education even though I have been, had to take terms off here and there for life and work, um, family, and uh, other times I've just <coughs> stayed going with just one credit to keep chipping away at my goal. Um, it has allowed me the flexibility to find my major as I was confused uh, as many students are when they enter college. Uh, but most of all, being a Marshall alumni, it, Portland Community College has provided me the opportunity to be involved in growing my com uh, community and making it better. Um, the Higher Education Student and Institution Success Committee correctly did identify the main barrier that's affecting students today, and that's financial assistance. Over 45% of PCC students receive student aid either uh, via the Pell Grant, Oregon Opportunity Grant, or subsidized student loans. We are asking you to push the legislature to increase the uh, support of two programs. Fund the community college support uh, fund, uh, and also support additional reinstatement and need-based college aid like the Oregon Opportunity Grant. In conclusion, I'm excited about what the future holds, but I'm encouraging the OEIB to invest in community colleges as they are the linchpin educational institution critical to achieving the fantastic goal of 40-40-20. Thank you.